morning, good morning, good evening, good daytime, good any time. I am Pink Poodle. Here is my Pink Poodle Maisie. And we are Pink Poodle too. Same colour hair. And what have we got today, Maisie? Yes, I know. We've got a cold box today. And a cold box. I'm going to put Maisie down. Say bye bye, Maisie. Hey. Bye. Um, a cold box is one of my alternative boxes that I get a month. Um, it's a small business run by a lovely couple called Misha and Carl. And a cult box is alternative in a sense. It is, um, what do you say? Um, I can't think of it. It's like, it does all different alternative things. Gothic and um, such like. Sometimes it's witchy, sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's vampire-y. It could be ghosty. Like last month with ghosts, I think. Or you know, cobwebs and some kind of other last month. I can't know what it is. Because, but this is the Summer Witch. And this is what it looks like. And you open it. There is a information sheet on the top. And the goodies are inside. Let me just get my glasses because I forgot to put them on. I need my glasses so I can't read them. I'll change over. So let's begin. Does that look better? We're in my fairy headdress today. Um, this is called Summer Witch and there you go so let's have a look so first of all we have this which is a charm with quartz um, white quartz maybe or pink quartz and pentacle and this is rose quartz pentacle and charm that's the first thing it's really nice this on your what you want to put it on so that's really nice i like that gotta find space because i don't have a lot of space on my dressing table then i have this tarot is it a tarot card necklace which is the sun because it is summer witch um okay but i mean yeah we'll get to that because otherwise we're gonna um so that's because there's other stuff on here that's um, uh, on here. And then we have a Earth Element Summer Meadow. Um, what is it called now? Candle. Okay, candle. Then we have, this is a Hecate Keys Potion Trinket Dish. It's really cute. There's that. And then we have, I'm trying to figure out, we've got some little butterflies, which is really cute. I like them butterflies, match my hair, I'm sure that's what she was thinking. I could put these as slides, couldn't I? I could put them in my hair now. Yeah, I might put them on a slide and put them in my hair because it looks quite cool. But that's what they're for. Could you put my hair? Anyway, oop, and I dropped mum. How long was it going to be before I dropped anything? God, honestly, I often wonder about myself. Can't get it. Oh, it's too far away. Oh, oh. There you go. Managed to get it in the end. <laughs> and then we have. There's just some information on here, so I'll read it out after I show you the box. Then we have this, which is the Summer Witch Amber and Sweet Orange Spray, which smells absolutely gorgeous. I like that as well. Then we have some sunflower petals. So... Uh, dried sunflower petals. Oh, is it the whole thing? I didn't realise that. It's a whole. Looks like it's a whole sunflower. What kind? Of, well, no. Like sunflower petals, which I am dropping all over the shop as well. So I'm going to, have to pick them up in a minute. God, I've dropped about four or five on the thing. So they sunflower petals. Then we have a. Letha Sabbat oil, which smells 
very nice as well. I'll tell you all about that in a second. Then we have some um, crystals. We have Carmelian, Tiger's Eye, and Green Venturing, which is um, stones you use for Letha, which is coming up, which is Sabbath, which is the summer. So this is this is a beautiful tiger's eye. Oh wow. Looks a bit like a herringbone. Let's see. That's beautiful. Um, and what else we've got? We've got some more stuff here. Oh, we've got another little purpley one this time. And we've got oh, as she drops what we've got. Oh, sorry guys. And then we've got this, which is a fairy summer fair lip balm by Natasha Faulkner. If I get her off, I can show you. It smells of orange. It's like orangey smell. It probably says it's orangey. Oh, blood orange. I didn't know that. It's blood orange. It smells like orange. So. I think that's everything that we've got in this box. Which I've got some sunflower things all over the shoppers down here. Right, so that is the box. So let's read about what it says. So it says, sunflower petals. Here we go. For happiness, positivity, fertility and abundance. Sunflower, sunflower follow the sun across the sky making them a widely variety with the sun and believed to attract happiness luck and abundance for thousands of years they also play a part of the fairy folklore throughout history and it is said that the spirits of the other side are attracted by the flower as it reminds them of the sunny world they once lived in how how to harness the magic of sunflowers sprinkle in the bath for happiness confidence luck and self-love add money bowls to draw prosperity add a spell jar to bags for luck and abundance planet sun element fire sabbat midsummer and mabon zodiac sign leo so you guys all about sunflowers then we've got the leaf sabbat oil which does smell really lovely, I must admit. An uplifting blend of ylang ylang orange patchouli essential oils. Blend of oils chosen to harness the power of the sun and enhance your spells. Then charged by the sun to help aid your in your solace celebrations and rituals. Leafu is to celebrate the midsummer, the longest day of the year. It is used at a time to reveal arts and honour the sun and the gifts of life brings to the earth and it's on the 21st of June Letha which is at Midsummer the Midsummer Festival and then it says a few ideas how to use your oil anoint your spell candles and tools add a few drops to money bowls and boost abundance add a sp spell jar or bags for prosperity happiness fertility and energy Use aroma to help relax, meditate, and manifest. Right, ways to celebrate Letha. Watch the sunrise and sunset. I'd like to do that, but it's very difficult in London to see these things, and I don't live up. I only I've got a house that's got like ground and a, you know, it's a two-story house, normal house, but you can't really see the sunset too well because of all the buildings. Nice if you could see it though, but I would like to do that. See, watch the sunrise and sunset, decorate your altar with flowers, sun charge your crystals, make sun water, harvest herbs, have a bonfire, fire magic, dance, sing and have a joyful time. I will probably do the latter. And it says, so that's that. So it says some crystals. So we have throughout th a thoroughly chosen selection, thoughtfully thoroughly, I'm like thoughtfully chosen selection of stones that embody summer, represent positivity, prosperity, vitality, and nature. 
the perfect stones to celebrate summer solstice and lammas so we've got the tiger eye which is absolutely stunning which i've already shown you and i think it is very one of my favorite looking tiger eyes i've had um this is grounding prosperity vitality june birthstone zodiac leo not my sister um planet sun and earth element fire and earth sabbat lisa right and then we've got green adventurine which is abundance luck uh, success august birthstone zodiac cancer planet mercury element earth and air and sabbat is lammas and last one we've got chameleon it's like a bit quick you see it looks a bit like amberish it's got like little flecks in it i don't know if you, you can see that there Got that little flex. Right, yeah. I've got none of my rings on, have I? I should have wearing my rings. And this is Carmenian Motivation, Confidence, Courage, July Birthstone, Zodiac Virgo, Planets, Mars, Sun, Element, Fire, Sabbats, Letha, Lamas, and Samhain. So then we've got the thing that says the Sun Tarot card. Remember, we've got the um, necklace. So we've got a necklace with the Sun on it. The Sun Tarot card artwork from Rider Waite deck created in 1909. A large sun, oh, sorry, a large sun bright shines in the sky, responding to the source of life on Earth. Underneath the sunflowers grow, the card shines with optimism and positivity. The necklace will bring the wearer positively, fun, success and vitality. So you can see that. Oh, see that better now, the sunflowers underneath and that. Oh, there's that. And then it just says, spell using items in this box. Says um, what to do. Um, uh, to watch your swing and it says about Hecate's keys Hecate key trinket dish keys have been connected with the goddess of witches Hecate since ancient times the key symbolise her role as keeper of the keys universe and afterlife so there's that so that is a really good box this month I really did enjoy this box I must admit, this is one of my favourite boxes so far this year. I really do like it. So in my Summer Witch, I got oops, some butterflies that want to fly away. So we've got a couple of butterflies. We've got a few butterflies to so show you in a minute. We've got some fairy lip or black or oh, blood orange um, lip balm. We've got a charm with oh, rose quartz. We've got a Hecate trinket dish we've got some lovely um summer witch room spray a summer candle some sunflowers ooh, some tiger's eye chameleon and adventurine a sun dial um tarot card and some oil um what is it called soil lisa sabbat oil so this is my sandwich box, which I think is a really nice box. Plus we've got, oops, sorry about that. Plus we've got other oh, spray bit of this actually. Cause they, oh, it smells really nice. Oh it's, uh, oh, it's amber sweet orange room spray. That smells really like. Plus we've got some of these I can make into little clips, which I have the things to put them on. Let me see, let me find if I can find one. I've got one in my hair actually. Hold on. I could put these on here. Stick them on there like that, or not like that, or that like on here. Oh, it's got a magnet on. It's a magnet. Oh, okay. We'll stick it in my hair then. Didn't realise that was a magnet. Okay, well I'm sticking it in my hair. And so I've got these. A little magnet on. Oh, they're cool. There's a lovely summer hair slide. It's 
trying to sort of stick because I've got it in. Was it that's it? Look at that. Got in my hair now. Apart from these ones, you can't put in your hair. So that's a really good box. So I really enjoyed that. So thank you, Cult Box, for doing that box. It's absolutely brilliant. Michelle, you did did amazing. Really love it. I love all of it. I love these. I can put in my hair. Um. Yeah. So look, look, those are sunflowers. So yeah, it's brilliant. Absolutely fantastic. So thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please pop it onto your cult box. Have all the details in down in the um, description. And um, see what you think. She there's lots of other things she sells on that her um, on her website that is her, um, to do with um, alternatives. Um, lots of bats and things and lots of different things. Go along and have a look. If you're interested in getting these her own boxes, then you know, you can get a one-off box if you don't want to subscribe. And then see what you think. I mean, there's different themes throughout the year. Some some themes are not to some people's liking, so they don't buy them. But I've been getting this box ever since she's done it. And I, I've always been quite happy with everything I've got. I've got a nice array of stuff in my fairy room. You'll see there's lots of things from your cult box there and witch casket and that. And, yeah, I've got a brilliant thing so anyway thanks so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it please give me a pause up if you didn't enjoy it then give me a pause down that's fine too but um please leave a message i would love to see a message i'm sorry i have no poodles anymore to say hello to you as you know my poodle passed away on the 2nd of may and um life without him is hard i'm going to say that now it is very very hard it's very quiet there's no you know what I mean? He was my constant companion and like he's not with me all the time. Although having said that, oh no, the cats have disappeared now. The cats are gone. They, they were in here, but they've decided to go away now. They were doing this earlier. I'll show you quickly on my thing. Um, uh, where are we? Uh oh. Where did I put them? I thought I put the cats on here. Yeah, I did. It's got holly grass. The holly was eating grass. It's got earlier. holly. You're eating your grass. Oh, the good I'm girl. I'm eating grass, so she's eating the grass. And uh, um, yeah, I forgot to tape and play. And I was shocked. See, Jesse and Billy's gone on their honeymoon, related honeymoon. They've gone to um, Spain, and they were FaceTiming me from Spain, and I showing them playing with the toys <laughs> so oh well they were in here but they've gone now they decide they want to be with mummy all right and take care everybody hope you everybody have a lovely day and enjoying this beautiful weather and always remember it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't until next time on pink poodle 2 guys thank you for watching and thank you for for the support and the love that you show me thank you take care guys bye Mwah.